Hello guys, welcome to the Hive Production and in this video we are going to model football, basketball and the volleyball on 3D Studio Max. So let's get started first of all. Uh, I have a 3D Studio Max as interface and uh, I'm just going to go to the extended primitives and uh, first I'm going to create a football. That's why I have chosen this extended primitives from the this option Hydra and I'm going to draw this something like this normally it looks like a diamond so what you will have to do you will have to go to the modify panel and uh, just find out dodec icons when you click on it so you will get a basic shape of a football and uh, it is something like this so your next step has to be uh, family primitives so when you will increase the value of uh, P, so it will get a cl more close shape like a football. So as you can see that I have already chose this and uh, next option is that right click on it and go to the editable poly. After getting the editable poly you will have to select this edge and select in the entire football and make them split. When you split this, so these all the polygons and all the faces will going to be separate. So you will have to select this one. And uh, now you will have to go select uh, the modifier list and you will have to find out the turbo smooth. So as you can see that I have already details about some turbo smooth, but it is not getting a smooth it's just because we have spread the all the edges so increase the alteration let's go it like this and I'm going to apply another modifier which is called spherify press S two or three times and you will find out this spherify modifier and I will just select the spherify so now you can see this ball are actually proper in the rounded shape so what you will have to do first come back to the editable poly and uh, because I'm I only want, want to the texture of all of them so I'm just going to select all of them I'm going to go to the material editor and uh, after editor I'm going to give them a white color after giving the white color I'm just going to select the polygons who has five corners in this football and uh, select all the polygons who has five corners So now I have already select the all five corners so this time I'm gonna go to the material 2 and I'm going to give them a color which is which is going to be black or maybe dark gray so these have these we have a basic texture right now so after that I'm gonna go to the turbo smooth and spherify so it actually look like a football but one thing let me make sure that football has a separation in these every every phase that's why we have split them so what we're going to do we are just going to select them go to the modifier list find out the added poly and after added poly you will have to select uh, this polygon options and select all of them and make them extrude when you will extrude them and increase the value so you will find out every polygon has a separation in their own extrusions so this looks a uh, little separated so we have find out the separation as well one thing make sure if you if it is your wish that you want to make them smooth so you can make them smooth as well okay fine so let's take a side please yeah and next target is just to model basketball so I'm gonna to go to the standard primitives after standard primitives I'm gonna take this sphere and I will draw the sphere from the top like this okay 
and uh, here I'm going to convert them into editable poly but before editable poly I'm going to go to the modifier list and uh, just decrease the segments which is the half of it like 16 and convert them now into the editable poly after converting editable poly you will have to select the polygon options and select the half of the ball because we are going to duplicate them and as well we have you to delete the top delete them now we need to fulfill the top according to the directions or according to the uh, design of basketball so you will have to select the edges go to the top viewport zoom in them in just take four edges from the right side and the four edges from the left side and just pick them bridge when it will bridge so it will be something like this and then you will have to go to the third option which is the border select this and give them a cap select this and give them cap so now it is fulfilled but unfortunately we have this detail is missing so for that purpose again go to the top viewport select the border or edge it's up to you but you will have to find this option which is called cut and join the edge from this to this so as you can see that i have already joined this basketball take the vertex and select the edges make them a little bit scale it down or maybe squish okay now you will have to find out symmetry in the modifier list so i'm going to find symmetry here and you can see this is the symmetry plane so try all the mirror axis x axis does not work y axis no z axis can work that's perfect after taking this axis i'm going to delete the history of uh, this basketball and how we delete we already create editable poly okay so now i'm going to give them a modifier which is called as verify okay why i'm going to give this is verify modifier because let me show you if you see the top and the bottom side of it if i disappear as verify so it is totally straight when i turn on this verify it is getting a sphere that's why we put this verify in this football and in this basketball as well so now I'm going to give them again editable poly and this time you will have to find out turbo smooth so now my ball is getting smooth what's the next step the next step is to take out the texture and the design of the basketball so from the again convert them into editable poly take the H2 and uh, from the top side I'm going to give this horizontal center edge and get this vertical center edge and as well I'm going to give one two three third edge selected double click on it and from this side one two three third edge so we have already select the design of this basketball after taking the design you will have to go to the chamfer and increase the value of chamfer something like this great so basically we only need to get texture as well like we have textured or we have shaded this ball so the basketball turn right now I'm gonna go to the top viewport and uh, we'll find out the edge okay so let's see select this center horizontal vertical horizontal this top and this bottom 
make them a ring when you ring them so let's see we have already selected these all the ages we have chamfered okay so press control and select polygons so you will find out these kind of a selection right now okay so without wasting time go to the extrude and uh, give them local normal like this and decrease the value of extrusion into the minus side when you will do this so just go to the material and uh, apply the same black color in this and uh, press ctrl i for the inverse selection and uh, take some texture of basketball which is i have already um, downloaded from the google apply on it so we have already textured this basketball I'm gonna give them a UVW map and uh, select this box UVW map and then give them a box as well you will have to give the texture size it is too much low in size 5 by 5 by 5 okay so i'm gonna give them a uw sorry i'm gonna give them a mesh smooth which will smooth them so we have already textured our basketball as well so the third thing is my volleyball take a box like this so I'm just gonna give the value of suppose 2 by 2 by 2 because volleyball is uh, low in size okay okay give them color something like this so what am I going to do I'm just going to convert them into veritable poly and after converting to edible poly i'm going to select these two only two edges and i'm just going to give them a texture like this edges like this same thing i'm going to give them from this side and same thing i'm going to give them from this side and this third time for uh, top back side and the bottom so we have already give them basic texture go to the material and I'll assign the approx uh, red color like this and take yellow color here yellow or maybe close to the orange let's see like these polygons assign this color okay okay apply the modifier which is called turbo smooth oh sorry before applying select these all edges and make them split and after selecting make them turbo smooth so it will smooth something like this you can increase the operation of three percent and then apply spherify so as you can see guys it looks a proper proper volleyball i'm gonna give them a double poly select all the polygons and make them extrude in a various different direction so we have to extrude very carefully in a little, little amount and then apply mesh smooth 
two percent or creation so guys I hope you like this tutorial and if you like this so I request you to subscribe my channel press the bell icon thank you so much for watching this I hope you love this tutorial playing with some balls <laughs> I'll give you the next time. Thank you so much.